guys, welcome to another Bish Dash Soft video. I'm Nuj Bizur2 and I'm Fuvrer B14 and today we're gonna talk to you about the Haley Strategic Flat Pack. Yeah, so uh, this is a product that myself and B14 use uh, in our plate cares and chest rigs um, and it's a really nice product and can be used in three different ways. So you can use it as a pack for your plate carrier. Let me just show you. Yeah, so like this, as you can see, Sorry. So as a pack for the plate carrier, so it's really slim, really nice, because it has uh, molly straps on the on the back, so you can attach it directly. And you can use it as a standalone uh, backpack, because it has the, the straps uh, on it. So for civilian use, everyday carry, it's it's really nice. And of course, you can attach it to a chest rig. So this is a water soul systems chest rig with a pathfinder and you can attach it by just using the buckles as you can see and then on the side you have two yeah, more and you have two more on the side and the bottom one has the, the strap there you go yeah so and you have now a pack for your chest rig so it's a really nice product with all of these uh, features so if you want to have hydration on your chest rig, uh, you can use it as a bag for uh, a if, if you're going to the range and some shooting, and of course for law and military law enforcement and military work. Yeah. Now speaking a little bit about the features of the uh, flat pack, the first thing that you can actually see is this really nice. Take this out of the way. Really nice uh, velcro uh, velcro uh, um, at the panel that they have here, which allows you to put pretty much anything you want. Bear in mind that I have pretty big patches on this, so you kind of you kinda get the feel of it. Uh, it's really nice Velcro, actually. It's really strong. Uh, as you can see, if you want to take something out, you ha really have to pull on it. Um, so that's really good, um, these Velcro straps. Another uh, feature that I really, really like, and you won't actually notice it at first glance, is the um, the, pull, the pull, uh, um, pull, tabs. pull tabs for the uh, zippers, because I, we can show it in uh, in, uh, in a zoom later. It really um, fits your thumb and your index when you pull up on it. It's kind of a little thing, but hey, it's all about details. So again, it's it has a slight bend to it, so it feels really nice when you actually grab on it and just pull it. And speaking about the uh, actual zippers, they they just work really yeah, nice. They run really smooth. They run really smoothly. You don't have to actually uh, do any any adjustments, you know sometimes those zippers you have to struggle with it to get it closed. No, this is actually runs very smoothly back and forth without zero effort whatsoever. Taking a look at the uh, <clears throat> shoulder straps, they're adjustable in length. So you actually you can, uh, with this uh, little Velcro as well, adjust if you want a tighter or, or a little bit looser. Uh, it does have as well on the side these little, uh, these little bungees that will keep in place your hydration cord and well whatever you want to run through this actually it's they're really strong and it feels really really durable <clears throat> so it, again it won't it won't be something that just breaks with uh, with time the actual buckles itself um, are strong very strong yeah, plastic think, as well i think they're itw uh, buckles so really high quality from that brand yeah the molly, the molly on the um, <clears throat> on the on the um, on the on this uh, the panel here are very. Uh, it's very good. Yeah, it's simple. Standard, yeah, yeah. Standard. Uh, they they don't have any like metal pins or anything like that. It's um, just a fabric and it's harder here on the bottom so that you can le really weave it in through the molly and attach it really securely. Yeah, at the bottom it just you know goes back in and it just because it's really really strong this last part and really hard to bend. It will keep it in place very securely. Now it does have as well a little handle, so you can actually carry it if you need to. And <clears throat> um, has a opening here on the top where you can just uh, put your uh, antennas yeah. if you have it. Wiring, wiring, yeah, hydration, <clears throat> uh, tube. Exactly, yeah. pretty much everything. Now, like uh, B02 said, it has two uh, <clears throat> two main uh, settings. Let's call it that. The flat version when it's pretty flat and very uh, low profile yeah, very, slim, yeah. very slim and then 
This is the main feature of this pack. Obviously, that's why it's called a, a flat pack because it goes all the way uh, to, uh, to the flat position. But if you need to, it just by um, by uh, unzipping the uh, and sorry, uh, taking these uh, zippers and just running them through all the way, you'll see that it will just gain some space. So again. For example, for this um, for this pouch that you had here, it just grows a little bit, and you keep you can store a little bit more stuff on it if you need to. And of course, the main part of the um, the the pack itself does exactly the same thing, and will actually give you a lot more space. So it goes from flat all the way to full extension. So there you go. So you can store a lot of things inside, and just to give you an idea of what you can store inside, we're not going to stuff it with a lot of stuff, but we can actually put a, just a second, a helmet, which is pretty big. Everybody knows uh, the uh, normal helmet size. You probably have one in your house, so you'll know what we're talking about. It is pretty big. So if you can fit a full helmet inside, imagine all the other stuff that you can put inside. There you go. No effort whatsoever, it's now, I would say, pretty much full, you can still see that you can still fit more stuff inside, don't forget this pouch here as well. Um, and it has the hydration bladder on the inside. Oh yes, and I never take off my water because I'm very lazy, so it has already, I would say, half a liter of water inside and a, um, uh, uh, um, sorry. <laughs> A helmet inside, <laughs> completely forgot the word for it. And it's, you could still fit more more things, so this is pretty incredible. Again, I've tried a lot of uh, uh, backpacks uh, yeah. throughout my Airsoft uh, experience and I have to say this is by far the best one, quality-wise and, <clears throat> and uh, even storage, I think, because you can pretty much fit anything you want. And if you don't want to uh, just store anything, you can just leave it flat, so it's not, uh, not just flapping around when you're not using it. Uh, you can always uh, flatten it down. Yeah, it's nice to have that low profile option. On, yeah, exactly. uh, it goes really well on your plate carrier. But if you need, because the, you're going to, for example, if you're a law enforcement or military guy and you need to go to a mission and it has like, you need more mission essential items, yeah, you can expand it. Or if you don't, you just want to run your hydration, you can leave it at the flat configuration and you're good to go. So I think it's a really nice idea. I think it was one of the first uh, packs that I saw uh, with this feature. I don't know if there was another one before it, but yeah, really nice idea uh, from Hilly Strategic. The uh, pack itself, uh, as we saw, it can expand by un unzipping those, those zippers. Uh, it has three compartments, so you have the, the main one, the, the, the pouch. So it's a really uh, simple, it's just a big pocket and it has a smaller compartment uh, on the inside for your hydration. We have here a source hydration bladder, so really simple. Uh, here on the front, just above the Velcro panel, you have a horizontal zipper and you have a slimmer pocket, but it goes all the way uh, to the bottom. It's pretty big. The pack, yeah. And you have a smaller one, which is this one over here. And once again, just a simple pocket. So a lot of storage um, and it's very simple on the inside. So. Yeah, I think we're really happy with it. Really, really happy. Yeah. Speaking of, about, well, we're obviously really happy with this, but it does have actually some, some cons yeah, to this as well. It has some cons. So, uh, this first con, uh, maybe some guys would like to have some molly uh, webbing on the outside yes. to attach other things, but that's not really the idea with the flat pack, so I understand why they didn't put it, uh, they didn't put molly, because um, it's uh, supposed to be the slim, the lightweight as possible. But the for me, the biggest con is the lack of organizational features on the inside. So the pockets are just simple pockets. It could have like smaller mesh pockets some inside. Some bungees inside. Yeah, some bungees uh, to just put like a flashlight, um, pens, whatever. So I think they could have done a better job on the, on the inside part of the pack. I don't know if they were gonna work on that, yeah, basically and, the inside doesn't match the yeah, outside quality. The inside is just, it's very simple. Um, and of course the other con is the price. Uh, the price tag it's is pretty steep. Yeah, it, it's like 180 euros. 100, 200, uh, sorry, 180, 200, I would say that. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you're getting really, really, really uh, top quality material. 
uh, like I said, the, the, the zippers, the, uh, the panel, the actual quality of the fabric. Yeah, the detail on the pull tabs, with, which has the, the Helio Strategic logo. <laughs> yeah. uh, but it's all about the details, but at the end of the day, you could uh, feel that they could still improve it and it's not... It for the price tag. Yeah, for the price. For it the wouldn't price increase thing. that much the price, so again, just like, uh, like Carlos said, some inter in internal modifications would be appreciated. Yeah for at least organizing the uh, the stuff that you want to put yeah. inside. The, the pack itself costs more than, than many plate carriers out there, so yeah, <clears throat> it, it, the price it's really one of the big cons on it, uh, considering it could have some more stuff to improve. But nonetheless... Even, even thinking about that, would I buy another one? I don't think so. And I think this mm -hmm. is going to be, uh, you know, you could never say I'm done, I'm never going to have another backpack or whatever, because Maybe they'll have this model after seeing this review, but with uh, the internal uh, uh, organization, yeah. then I'll have to buy that one. <laughs> but um, I think this is going to last me for a long time because, again, it does pretty much whatever I want it to do. Yeah. If it's a big game, open it up, put everything you want. Food, a lot of food I eat like a, like a pig. So <laughs> food, 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 sweaters, whatever you want to keep on it. And if it's just a four hour game, just flatten it yeah. and just take water and that's it, done. Or for civilian use, you can or use it as a back. Uh, it comes in several colors, uh, multicam, coyote brown, black, ranger green. The multicam version is more expensive, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Uh, it has the multicam uh, Velcro, right. yeah, so yeah. a little bit more detail. Yeah, but it's a, a little bit more expensive. Um, and it, it, Hilly Strategy Goalie makes uh, also makes the flat pack, flat pack Plus, which is a bigger uh, version of it. The so, big brother. Yeah, the big, the big brother of this one. So it's just, it's just, uh, it's the same, all the same feature, but it's bigger in size. Okay. So yeah, so really happy with it. Uh, we recommend it. Of course, there are some replicas out there. There are. Uh, if you don't want to break the bank and get like, I know that TMC makes one, Emerson makes one. Funny enough, they have the organization things inside. Yeah, <laughs> the, T the TMC one has uh, some bungees on the inside. Yeah. So, yeah. And I think Pentagon also makes like a similar model. So, but if you want the real deal, of course, Hilly Strategic is the way to go. And uh, I've, we've played this uh, with this backpack like in pretty much every weather condition out there. Yeah. We've... Uh, 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 crawled, we did pretty much uh, anything you could do with these things and it looks new so again it's pricey but quality comes with a price yeah and uh, I'm pretty happy with this um, I'm sure you are as yeah, well when I happy. once I saw it I was looking for that perfect perfect um, backpack for the plate carrier because it, it was nothing out there that I really really liked it's like too, stuff there's too big stuff there's too small stuff that just it doesn't look good once I saw uh, cars with this one I said I gotta have that one because it looks like exactly yeah. what I want yeah so yes pretty happy with this one uh, thumbs up from me and I think from you as well yeah. and uh, that's it I yes guess. Well, so thank you for so much for watching uh, see you next time okay, okay. catch you later yeah bye